We're here on the Waterlily site in Lawrence Weston. It's a new sustainable development of 33 homes being developed by Bright Green Futures. Our ambition is to put people and planet at the core of housing. The way we do that is by building highly sustainable communities that are zero carbon. Here at Waterlilies, this is the first time in the UK we've brought together a large solar array across housing, a central battery store, electric vehicle charging, and air source heat pumps, all integrated with a smart system. All of the homes will have large solar arrays and we're going to link all those solar arrays together in a microgrid, which is a small private grid that is owned and operated across the estate to share that solar between all the homes. So it doesn't matter if one person is out, their solar panels can still provide electricity to their neighbours. And what we're doing here is we're building a large battery right into a renewable project in order to be able to time shift energy from when it's being produced to, to when it's needed. And that's going to be a real demonstrator that, that lets us convert to 100% zero carbon by 2050. Internationally, in California and New York, they've been developing microgrids, but here in Bristol, this will be the first place in the UK where we've delivered this kind of technology at scale and, and fully integrated. It was great when we met CPRO and Damon and Bristol Energy Co-op and, and their investors because there was immediate bonding because of the value share. Beck is a non-profit, community-owned organisation that has already put 16 renewable projects into operation since 2011. They are going to put share offer funds, £204,000, into the grid scale battery that's here. The BEC share offer is online now on the Ethics platform. It provides a 3.5% return on investment. Private individuals can invest between anything from £100 to £100,000. I really encourage you to support that share offer and help us build the next generation of renewable technology.